All right, guys, what is up? And welcome to what I can only describe as another absolutely epic day. Um, I'm not really quite sure where to start with this video because what's about to happen is ridiculous. I, I'm still, basically the last few days or the last few weeks have been so busy and flat out that today has approached so quickly that I haven't really had time to even contemplate it, but basically we are on the road now to collect a new car. You'll find out more about that shortly. But a bit of backstory first. Uh, earlier in 2015, uh, I was really fortunate to be invited out to Bahrain and I spent quite a lot of time there on track with uh, the Porsche 991 GT3. I'm sure you can see where this is going. <laughs> and after spending just half an hour with that car, I was absolutely blown away. It is ridiculous. Now, I've never been a huge Porsche fan unless it's been the sort of GT3s, the GT3 RSs. Um, but after driving this 991 GT3, I was sold. It was absolutely fine. Blowing. The way this thing sounds when it's revved up to 9,000 is insane. The turning is amazing. It's just an incredible package and it makes you feel great when you're driving it. Anyway, so ever since then, I would say for the past sort of 11 months, I've been searching for the right GT3. And two weeks ago, the right car just so happened to pop up for sale and what did I do? I went and bought it <laughs> which I'm still a bit I'm still in a little bit of shock because today is the day we're gonna go down and collect that car it's ridiculous so we're on the road and we're gonna go and pick up a 991 GT3 see you tomorrow all right guys what is up we have just reached JZM Porsche in Kings Langley I've just been inside quickly to see the car. It looks absolutely epic. These guys are so good. The dealership as well is super clean, super cool, and they have some really tasty cars inside. So uh, yeah, without further ado, let's go check out this car. Front and rear, and you've got a little tool, tool in here. 
that's it, and then lift and then flip that lift back in, and yeah, that's back in. And then on this side, yeah. we have three. Yeah. The eyes are good. So there is no. Yeah, that's about good. Good man. Good man. Well, last time I used that, I actually had a, a hole that was too big to do a bit of spray. Spray it out the side. But yeah. We can find the pit up on the screw in the center. Yeah. Fine. Yeah. Rips aside. Yeah. 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 Okay. So pretty much everything on the front. Signature Porsche code. It still sounds like a Porsche. 
like a proper GT Porsche. I mean, it's it's the business. And these bucket seats, they're really, they're hugging me nice. That just makes me want to get on the track, you know? And looking in my rear view mirror, not only have I got a massive wing, but I've got scaffolding from a roll cage as well. It's just like this race car in this thing, you know? Ah, oh, the steering feels lovely as well, and weighted. And I cannot wait to get to grips with this thing and just, under, just understand how great it is. It feels so purposeful. Even at this speed, it just feels so in tune with the tarmac, you know? It just feels like a road going race car. It's 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 stiff, but it's still well dampened that it's not gonna like shake out your teeth. Yeah. Cool, very, very cool so far. And it has, you know, okay, it doesn't have the old Metzger engine in it, but you can distill that sort of idle chunter that you've got from the 997. It's not quite not quite bad, but Before I bought this car, I was researching exhausts. I'm gonna have to spend some time with it. I don't, is it gonna need one? I don't know, it sounds epic as it is. I don't know. Let's spend some time with it and see. Visibility's good, everything's good. Everything is more than good, everything is absolutely epic. something 
like the F12. The Speciali, where this thing is smattered in front of all of the controls and all of these stores here are actually on the steering wheel. I'm lucky for this, it's just the steering wheel. And actually, that's quite a refreshing experience because it's just, it just says to you, drive it. That's, you know, drive it. I like this. Check back in a few days' time with the video on this car. My sort of intro. 